What, are we ever going to use the other light? And it, Was there we, two? Yeah, there's the other one sitting oh, right there. Oh, man. What a great... What a great Christmas present. I know. And um, speaking of that, are you sure that it's supposed to go up like that and not like... No, but I feel like we look great in that viewfinder. Is that what it is, a viewfinder? Is that what that's called? Welcome back to another Weekend Rewind. I don't know if that's what we call these. It's the freaking weekend. But it's Friday. About to have me some... Well, so we can't sing that anymore. We're not allowed to do our Kelly music, I don't think. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> Like, I know there's a lot of radio stations that won't play his music anymore. Oh, I thought, my, I, thought I had my ID <clears throat> Anyways, what are you guys up to tonight? I just got back from playing Bunko. I got back from... I didn't get back from anywhere. I sat here the entire night with uh, Finley and his friend. And they're two six-year-olds, so you can imagine how that went. A and then time. Camden and three of her friends, and she's 16 and her friends are too, so you can imagine how that went. A great time. Yeah, a great time. Well, I was personally hanging out with a bunch of women who are around 40 to 65, so you can imagine how that went. It seems like you had a great time. I did. I got to hang out with my, my, my girls, uh, Jenny and Kimmery. Always a good time. We went to the bar. Congratulations, Kimmery. Oh, wait, we Kimmery. did not go to the bar. We went to Bunko. Wow. <laughs> I'm playing some Bunko. Do you guys play Bunko at home? I'd never, I mean, I've heard of this game. Where Where did we first hear about it? I first heard My about mom. it. Yeah, it was your mom. It's a You're dice right. game. Yeah, it's been like, well, now it's been like six years, but I had never ever heard of it. And she oh. said they used to play it back in Kansas, and it's been around for a long time. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, I guess I just didn't know you a lot of women. You money, and then we play left, right, center. You guys play like left, a, right, center? Yeah, it's like a neighborhood thing. It's a very good time. We're hosting it at our house next month. If you'd like to come, feel free. It's good. It's a good time. It's a good time. I would still like to know why on earth you thought it would be a good idea to tell people that we can host it. Listen, everybody Mom, in the group. Doing off. Everybody in the group has to host, and it's our turn. The cookies are. Burning. I need to go get cookies. One moment. Uh, I don't feel like that should be a rule. You shouldn't have to host, especially without running it by your husband. Too bad. You see what I have to deal with? It's why I drink. Between her and the kids. I'm just kidding. They're great. And I love them so much. This is awkward. Just you and I. I don't know what to say. Because I don't know no matter what I say, you're not going to say anything back. So I'm forced to uh, continue the conversation and make it, you know, keep flowing. I feel like I'm on a first date with someone that we can't talk, frankly. And I'm not very good at communicating and articulating my feelings. So it's very tough for me to sit here and talk to you. I like when people talk to me and then I can think of something to say back. But I don't know how to initiate the conversation. I never, I'm not good at it. Let's just say that. I'm not good at it at all. As a matter of fact, it makes me quite uncomfortable. And quite, I become quite awkward, as you can tell. So, yeah. So you might wonder. Well, Chris, don't you have a vlog? Yeah, I do. And we could be the worst vloggers of all time. I'm not gonna lie. We, I mean, we, we very well could be. Hi. Hi. Just having a conversation with uh, the camera. <laughs> Are those cookies? We made cookies. Little bunny cookies for Easter. They smell good. What were you guys talking about in here? Um, it, just about how awkward it is because the camera w doesn't talk back, so I have to no. lead the conversation, which I'm not good at. So anyway, what have we been up to? What have we been up to? We've booked our trip. You guys saw that. Um, we watched videos today about what cruise ships look like and what they yeah, have on them, and that yeah, was exciting. The Carnival Cruise, yeah, Finn got super excited about that. Well, I wouldn't say super excited, but he was excited. I've said to myself, self... You're going to let the kids have fun and buy whatever they want to and spoil them and have a great family vacation. I'm going to really try to stick to that, but probably won't. Yeah, she, we've done this before. I'm what you call a uh, fun police. That has been said before. <laughs> it has. I don't like chaos. Well, in certain situations. You do? You seem to like chaos when you're um, buzzed. 
I do like chaos in certain situations, but with my kids, I don't like chaos. I don't like, like, buying stupid shit, unless it's my stupid shit. Yeah. We've been going to a lot of spring training games. I have only been to one. Oh, well, I've been to two. I feel like I've been to three. Haven't I been to three? Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, one got canceled. Well, these are good. We haven't talked about how Fiddling started baseball. That's been new. Finley started baseball, Coach Pitch. He's playing for the city this year. And it was so cute when I picked him up <coughs> the other day from practice. He got to, like, throw the balls to the other kids. And he thought he was so cool. Yeah, and he was like, I'm like a real coach now, and it was so cute. Tomorrow night. <laughs> <laughs> we get to go out with one of my favorite people in the world, and I'm really excited. That's what this was? I thought you were going to say something nice to me, or about me. No. <laughs> Tomorrow night, we are getting to go out with my maid of honor. <laughs> she was my maid of honor, but one of my favorite people in the world. Funny story, too. I only met her because she hated me. She didn't hate you. Yes, yeah, she did. She was Chris's friend. And she hated me when we first started dating. And then one day, we broke the ice. The rest is history. Yeah, and now they're friends and me and Jade are not. You guys are still friends. Just We're friends. Okay, She's just yeah, my all time. And you guys are just first, friendly. It, every friend that I had, you are now friends with. Listen, and I, I'm not like really I'm just a likable person. I, yeah, I agree. I, mean, and I'm, I can't I, help it. You're jealous. It's okay. Just no, I was going to say unlikable, but <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not. First of all, I'm not jealous because I'm it, when I say that, it's all my friends that were girls. Like, and, and I guess it's natural that you would swoop in and like you'd be better friends with them. That makes sense. Um, that you'd be better friends with girls than I would. Because you kind of did it with Becky as well. Becky was my friend. Now she's your friend. And now I'm forcing out with fucking Jerry. <laughs> oh, Just know. kidding. I love you, Jerry Bear. Um... Just likable, guys. Who else? You dated with Carissa. Carissa became your friend, we not had, my friend. We had our moment in time. Um, who else? I feel like it, there's been a few more. Lisa. Lisa, yes. Yeah. No, Lisa always stayed true to you. That's but, true. But Thank she, you, Lisa. Good but, looking. But I still Good looking Lisa. out. Not that, you're, not that you're not good looking, but... Uh, same know. with, like, Becca. When Jason dated Becca, she became my friend, too. Yeah, that's true. Kara. Yeah, Kara was my friend, and you fucking stole her as well. Um, yeah, I think that might be it. So, if you guys need a friend. Anyways, Jade. My back and her hurts. boyfriend. We're going to go out with them tomorrow night, and I can't wait. We haven't worked out the babysitter situation yet, but we will. But I'm so excited. I have a feeling that Camden's going to do it. Or my mom, we'll see. Or your mom. Yes, son. Go. G okay, hang on. Finley wants another cookie. Yeah, go ahead and get one, bro. No, oh, they're in the oven. Don't get one. Oh, my God. Is we were just making fun of the people in the awards last night. Right in here. Take those off. I cannot take you seriously with that bullshit. Nonsense. And you don't have to take me seriously. No, I've ate two cookies, guys. So what? Totally ruined my diet. I'm gonna gain five pounds tomorrow. Why would you gain five pounds tomorrow? When I weigh myself, I'll be at five pounds, guaranteed. So you'll be up to what, 105? Oh, yeah. I wish, man. God, like... You wish you were 105 pounds? Pray for me. I need to be that. That's like, that. I don't even think that's healthy. No, but I need to be 125. I disagree. I don't... It's not about... First of all... Tell me if you guys agree. It is not about the number. It is about what... It, I mean, that sounds bad, but it's about what the person looks like. It's the way that someone wears their weight. I don't think it's about the number. And I would also like a tummy tuck while we're at it. Maybe a little lip injections. Why? So you can look like the cat lady? What's the cat lady? The one that did all that work, and now she's like her cheeks are like out to here, and she looks like a fucking feline cat. Just lip injections? That's not too much to ask for. 
I had a friend who got lip injections. Looks great. Who? I can't say her name on the vlog. Do I know her? Sam. Dehera? She got lip injections and they look good. Real good. This was a while ago though. I thought her lips looked kind of funny. <laughs> Anyways. And then when I get my tummy tuck, I'll be good. Ooh, you haven't shown your stuff yet. Show your tags. And your stickers. We're moving right along with this supply brand. No, we're not moving right along. Get that stuff. Yes, That's one thing I... they don't tell you when you go. Well, maybe they tell you, but I never went to clothing line school. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I started this process at the beginning of the year, as you guys know. It is March 15th, and production, the, the process takes a long time, let's put it that way. Who's that? Mom, did you see that, that tweet from Romeo Lacoste? No. Did she do what? Why? What happened? He was uh, Twitter messaging some girl and saying the most inappropriate stuff and other trending. Romeo Lacoste. I'll look it up. We're filming right now. We're we're filming. I'm gonna put that in there. What? We're filming. Okay. Anyway, um, yeah, the entire process takes a long time. Now I know why. You know how when you go to like these trade shows in like the middle of the summer and like all of like the winter stuff is like coming out and being shown that's why because it takes so fucking long to produce all this shit it's a rough life guys yeah it's you know, a rough life so i mean i guess that's what happens when you don't have little kids in china making your clothing closing your clothing get those let's can we show up the tag yeah so anyway i've got i've got the labels the hem labels and Oh my God. Stickers. I got stickers in. Which I'll throw in with all the shirts. Let me get up close and show you guys what okay, we're working yeah. with. So those are the labels that are going to be sewn. Focus, focus. Oh, is there backwards? it is. Focus, focus. Focus. That's it, guys. Anyway, those are going to be That's sewn gonna on the shirts. That's going to be on your shirt when you order one. Or when we send you one for free because we love our followers, subscribers. Yeah, so join the supply gang. Is that, is, can that be our thing? What, what's better than supply gang? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> supply crew? No, that doesn't sound good. Supply. The suppliers. Is that cool? No, I don't, I don't think so. I like that one. Supply squad. Join the supply squad. What are you, trying to be the vlog squad? Oh, are they the only people in the world that can yeah. use the word squad? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Become a supplier. It will, it, I guess if it catches on, I can't fight it. Anyway, just fucking buy supply, bro. That is it for us tonight. We are going to bed. Thank you guys She's so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button. It's up there. I don't know where it's at. Hit that notification button. That way you're notified every time we post. Is that no? It's not when you hit subscribe. Yes, is it? it is. It's a little bell. Oh, yeah, it is a little bell. I don't know where it's at. But anyway, hit it, and it'll notify you every time we post a new video. And we do that like three times a week. And I feel like we're getting better at it. We're not getting any funnier. It, it, we're probably getting less funny. This got weird. Peace, Peace. out.